Hey, welcome back to another video. For those of you new here, my name is Rochelle. And in today's video, we're gonna be doing an 18 month lock update and style. Do y'all see this growth right now? Let's talk about length, okay? If you've been following me from the beginning, you can tell how much my hair has grown. And if you've been here from the beginning, please be sure to let me know in the comments because y'all my hair has grown so so much since i started my lock journey it has been a year and a half like i remember doing my research and individuals all over youtube were saying to me you know make sure you take a lot of pictures because it's going to go by fast like it's going to go by fast and you really don't realize how quickly a year and a half goes by especially if you're living your life on autopilot like i was living my life on autopilot until i really and truly started my lock journey and i'm gonna get more into locks and spirituality later on in this um video but i do want to talk about my hair like right now i feel like it's healthy um it don't really look the healthiest i'm not gonna really dye it again and i do want to make it very clear that what i do to my hair is what i do to my hair i'm not here trying to tell anyone to do anything to their hair um i just want to make that very clear because i know dyeing your hair is literally killing your hair um, and I wanted this color, so I was going to go for it. Um, but I'm not dyeing my, I don't dye my hair that much. I'm not dyeing it again. Um, for now, at least, you know, I never know tomorrow I might change my mind, but as of right now, I am not dyeing it. And can you tell how fast my hair has grown y'all? Like I have so many black roots. I have more of a black roots, I should say than before like i literally dyed my hair two months ago and it has grown so much i did end up co combining two of my locks um because they were thin and i wanted them to be a little bit thicker so i did a little combination and trying to you know blend them together recently i found myself retwisting my hair a little bit more than usual so this is why this time i decided to go for a little style because you know retwist i have come to learn that retwisting isn't a style is really just to get your lock into the formation that it needs to be in and yeah i'm sick and tired of like after a week or two it looked like i had a retwist in like five months so especially because my roots grow out so quickly so i'm like you know what we're just gonna do some two strand twists that's like the quickest style i can do overall this took me about like two episodes of a show so that was like 43 minutes and 43 minutes so let's just say about an hour and a half it took me to do this and um honestly truly i was happy because when I first retwisted my hair ever, y'all, I'm going to leave a clip to it on here because it was so bad. It took me about three to four hours. I didn't know what I was doing and I was still in the starter phase. So, you know, my locks was just doing whatever they want to do. So I was so happy that now like I can actually do it real quick and it actually looks good, you know, but so so grateful for my locks as i said like i did not realize how fast a year and a half can go so can we talk about locks and spirituality because what it is what is it with having locks and being spiritual like i don't know my whole journey to getting locked started off very spiritual for me um i just woke up one day and I decided like that was the day, like I have to get locks. And ever since then, I just felt so grounded. I feel more love for myself. And it really helped me because guilty, I was probably guilty. Yeah, I can say, boldly say that I was in a phase where um, in my life, you know, where hair kind of defined my beauty and I didn't want my hair to be the definition of who I am because it's, it's hair and I felt like locks gave me that boldness and braveness because one it was something new it was something different first of all like 
that first couple of months, let's talk about it, going through what they call the quote-unquote ugly phase, that's the phase where I really and truly grew to love myself more in all areas of my life and realize like I'm not defined by my hair and just having experiences growing up where I felt like I was defined by my hair no I definitely was defined by my hair like that was such a powerful experience for me because really and truly like we're more than our hair you know but anyways um that was overall such a great experience and now like I'm like I love these bad boys I can see so many areas of my life where I have grown and I feel like my locks are just grown with me um and it's just beautiful I honestly can't tell you like what it is with locks and spirituality but there is something there there is something there okay and when I figure it out I'm gonna let y'all know because there's something there. Now, y'all, tell me why my hair colors ain't eating right now, okay? We got that dark brown, black in the back. And we got this nice blonde, bright blonde in the front. Like, oh my gosh, it is so beautiful. All I can say, though, what I have noticed in 18 months is that I have tremendous growth. My locks are starting to look like locks to me. <laughs> you know, they have length. I can do so much with them and overall like I'm just happy that I decided to stick through this process and not jump ahead and get insta lock because y'all there was a time where I got weak in my knees and I was like ooh, I'm gonna get some insta lock but I didn't do it so I'm proud of you Shell. yeah y'all I know I know I know we just trying to watch her get through this so I'm gonna just let y'all enjoy the rest of the video I did end up adding some bubbles or beads i think that's how they say in america some beads to the end of my hair just to give it a little flavor i'm gonna show y'all some pictures overall it turned out really well i end up just oiling my scalp after this and yeah thank y'all so much for watching and don't be afraid to check out my other videos you'll see the journey from the beginning till now and it has just been such a life-changing experience wouldn't change it for nothing thank y'all so much for watching and i'll see y'all in the next one